professional, in, professional developers conference. But the times there are changing, and I think that one of the great uh, the, the aspects of today's, all of today's sessions and this conference as a whole is that the internet platform brings about all sorts of opportunities, opportunities for developers to support the new, these new standards and to create new applications that broaden the market greatly. That's what this is about, and that's what this special keynote is about. So without any further ado, let me introduce Steve Jobs, president of Next Corporation, to talk to you about some opportunities that his company is bringing to the internet. Thank you. Good evening. Thanks for coming tonight. Um, I wanted to spend about 30 to 45 minutes talking about web objects and going into a little more detail. Of course, there'll be even more at the technical session tomorrow. And then try to answer any, any questions w which might come up. Uh, I've got a few slides. I'll, I'll repeat a little of what we did this morning, but maybe in a little more detail, and then take it, take it quite a bit further, if that's OK with you. Um, it's 7 o'clock at night, so please feel free to give me lots of feedback if you don't like something, or occasionally if you like something. Uh, so web objects, uh, we all heard about that this morning. Uh, it's, web objects is server-side software on the web. And we view the, app, the web as sort of filling out act one and entering act two. And act one was clearly uh, the web browser and static publishing. And you, know, you can look at a, a plethora of wonderful websites. This is, this is Next's up here. Uh, you know, here's Microsoft's, as you're, I'm sure, know and love. Here's Intel's. Um, and as I highlighted this morning, one of my favorites, Toy Story. And we've come an incredible distance with, with static publishing. It's amazing what we can do with such a simple, pervasive metaphor. Now, most of the activity that you hear about on the web today, even including most of the announcements today, are focused on the browser. And what they're focused on is enhancing the user interface of the browser. And what I mean by that is if you, if you take the user interface capabilities of, let's say, Microsoft Windows and say it has the capability equal to that surface area of that square, then the web's user interface has that capability, substantially less today. And what most of the effort is going into so far on the web 